Howdy, howdy, friends, and welcome back. Welcome to CVS Sunday, another awesome Sunday, another somewhat awesome CVS deal. The deals are definitely kind of not really there for the past couple weeks, but we can definitely grab Axe for a moneymaker, some free toothbrushes, some free to really cheap toothpaste, a couple paper deals. So they're, you know, we're finding them, we're finding the deals. So definitely stay tuned to the video. Um, if you're new here, welcome. I am so glad you're here. If you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel and following me along here and definitely give this video a like, definitely leave me a comment. I love to chit chat with y'all. And as always, any rebate apps that I ever use are always linked down in the description box below. So you can sign up using my codes and you'll get bonuses, extra money, extra points, all that good stuff when you sign up using my code. And also the printable Google Doc is down there as well. So make sure you print that out, take it to the store with you. Um, always double check prices because prices vary per store. Same with rebates, those can vary a little bit per account. So um, just always make sure you're double checking the math on that. So anyway, let's get in there. So we have a pretty sweet deal on the Head & Shoulders shampoo. So these smaller bottles, the 10.6 to the 13.5 are two for 12. And when you buy two, you're gonna get a $3 extra buck. So grabbing up two is gonna total you $12. We have a $3 off of two digital, as well as this three off of two printable that I got from the peachygoodeveryday.com website today. So after the $6 comes off, you'll pay $6, get back that $3 extra buck, making it just $1.50 each. I think that's a really good deal for head and shoulders. And then the other deal you can do um, is if you have this CRT, I'll go over it with you, are the, on these bigger sizes, they are two for 18. And when you buy two, you're gonna get a $5 extra buck. So we have that same three off of two. So once you use it, it's gonna be gone. So pick which deal you're gonna do. So three off of two and same thing, that same three off of two paper coupon will double dip. And I have a four off of 14 head and shoulders CRT. So after all those coupons come off, I'll pay $8, get back a $5 extra buck, making it same thing, $1.50 for each one. So definitely pick and choose. They are two separate deals. So you definitely can do both, but keep in mind that digital is one time use. Also keep in mind the PG Good Everyday Web um, <laughs> coupons expire in 24 hours. So definitely kind of want to wait until you're ready to do the deal because CVS guys, we talked about it last week, they're updating their system. So as of the 15th, most stores have kind of fixed how long they take expired coupons for. Um, I don't know how, what mine have changed to, but I've just been seeing it's anywhere between two to six days. Definitely not as high as it was, you know, 14 to 21 days. So you'll just have to test it out with your store. Um, I don't know what mines are, what mine is at yet either, but let me know what you guys are having um, them not scan anymore after the expiration. So we have the same deal this week as we did last week on the L'Oreal L5. It's buy two, get a $4 extra buck. They are priced $5.29 at my store. So two of them will total $10.58. There's a three off of two L'Oreal Digital if you haven't used it last week. And that three off of two L'Oreal paper coupon from the coupons.com website. I believe that one is no longer available to print, um, but if you have it, it'll take $6 off. So you'll pay $4.58, get back a $4 extra buck, making them just 29 cents each. We have a super de awesome deal on the Axe Fine Fragrance Sprays. They are buy one, get one 50% off. And when you buy two, you're gonna get a $4 extra buck. So there are two ways to do this deal. One is using a CRT. So if you don't have that, it's still gonna be awesome. So you can pick up two, two of them at buy one, get one 50% off. They're $8.79 at my store. It's gonna total $13.18. We have a $4 off to X Digital. So once that comes off, you'll pay $9.18, get your $4 extra buck back, and then you can submit on over to Ibotta for $6, $3 back on each, making them free and an 81 cent money maker. Super awesome. Don't forget if you're new to Ibotta, I have my referral code linked down in the description box below because when you sign up using my code, you'll get a $5 bonus when you submit your receipt. So if you haven't signed up, this is gonna be even better for you. 
So if we have this four off of 20 Axe deodorant CRT, um, you can actually pick up four. So four of them will total you $26.36. You'll use that $4 off digital, $4 off 20 CRT. So you'll pay $18.36, get back the $4 extra buck, and then submit over to Ibotta for $12 back, three on each, it is a limit of five. So you will, um, you know, hit get four. So you get $12 back there. And then you can submit over to either Shopmium or Alexa for $4 back on the other two that you buy, making all four of them free and a $1.64 moneymaker. Super awesome. So the Colgate total is spend $10, get a $5 extra buck. They are priced $5.29 at my store. So two of them will total $10.58. There is a $4 off two digital as well as a $1 off Colgate Digital. So both of those should come off. So you'll pay $5.58. Get back that $5 extra buck, making it just 58 cents for the two or 29 cents each. Some stores may have it cheaper at like $4.99. So if that's the case, two of them would be totally free. And you can pick up some toothbrushes to go along with your toothpaste. These are buy three, get a $5 extra buck. You wanna pick up three of the toothbrushes at $3.99. Three of them will total you $11.97. We have two digitals that should come off. There is a $2 off Oral B toothbrush, as well as a $5 off three Oral Care digital. So once these $7 comes off, you'll pay $4.97, get back that $5 extra buck, making three toothbrushes completely free. If you need shaving cream, there's a decent deal on the Gillette Foamy. They are buy one, get one 50% off. And when you buy two, you're gonna get a $3 extra buck. So buying two, they're $4.19 at my store, is gonna total $6.28. There is a $1 digital coupon. So you'll pay $5.28, get back that $3 extra buck, making them just $1.14 each, which I don't think is a bad deal for shaving cream. I feel like we haven't really got any deals on shaving cream in a while. Like even since I started couponing like more frequently and doing the videos and stuff, I haven't been able to stock up on shaving cream really. I remember when I first, like, I've like dibble dabbled, dilly daddled in couponing for off and on for like 10 plus years. And when I first started a while back, man, we would get shaving cream out the wazoo for like free. Now we have to pay just a bit. We have a decent deal on like Airborne. Definitely not the best deal. We've gotten it cheaper in the past. I think um, Walgreens is probably gonna be a lot cheaper this week, um, but it's less than two bucks. So not a terrible deal. So there, buy two, get a $10 extra buck. One of the cheapest things at my store at $9.79. They only have one, you need two, but they're $9.79. But they have a lot at $9.99, so only 20 cents more. So not a you know big difference. But buying two at $9.79 would total $19.58. We have a $3 off digital. And you can go to the coupons.com website and print off a $3 paper coupon. So once the $6 comes off, you'll pay $14.98. Get back, no, sorry, you'll pay $13.58. Get back a $10 extra buck, making it just $1.79 each. But if you don't have the paper coupon, instead of um, that, you can submit to Shopmium after for $3 back. So yeah, same deal. So like I said, not the best deal, but if you have one of those big high spend threshold CRTs, like 20 off of 80 or off of 100, I mean, that's like 20 bucks towards it there. So it might be something to pair into that. All right, so now for a paper product deal, I have two scenarios for this spend 20 get a $5 extra buck. So for this first one, you can pick up two of these Cottonelles at $10.49. Two of them are going to Toto. Oops, I lost it on my print to break out here. Oh my, where did it go? <laughs> okay, sorry. Two of them will total $20.98. We have a $1 Cottonelle digital. So you'll pay $19.98, get back your $5 extra buck. And then for the other one, you can submit over to Shopmium or Alexa for a dollar back, making the final cost $6.99 for each of them. Not too bad of a deal. This is also a great item to throw into those big high spin threshold CRTs. So let me show you another scenario. So for this one, you'll want to grab one of the Cottonelles at $10.49, use that $1 digital. And then you want to pick up 
two of these six equal 10 Scott paper towel rolls at $5.99. We have a $1 Scott digital. So all three products will total $22.47. After your two digitals come off, one for the Cottonelle, one for the Scott, you'll pay $20.47, get back that $5 extra buck. And then for the other Scott paper towel, you can submit over to either Shopmium or Alexa for a dollar back making the final cost $14.47 for all three, or just $4.82 each. Here's an easy, no coupons needed deal on the U by Kotex. Um, they are buy one, get one 50% off. When you buy two, you're gonna get a $2 extra buck. So you can pick up two of these ones priced at $1.89. Two of them will total you $2.83. No coupons, that's what you'll pay. You'll get back your $2 extra buck though, making it just 83 cents for the two or 41 cents each. Um, another way to do this deal is you can pick up two of the ones priced at $5.49. Two of them will total you $8.23. When I scanned it in my CVS app, two $2 digitals actually popped up showing attaching. So I'm pretty sure both of those will come off. So you'll get $4 off. So you'll pay $4.23. Get back that $2 extra buck, making it $2.23 for the two or just $1.11 each. Um, I don't think that's a bad deal for, well, these are 50, 40, yeah, great deal. So I just did one transaction. I grabbed the two head and shoulders, the three toothbrushes, and the two axe. My $3 paper coupon scanned perfectly fine. All my digitals came off perfectly fine. The two oral, um, the $5 and the $2 came off, the $4 axe, the $3 double dipped for the head and shoulders, and the four off 14 head and shoulders also came off. So I rolled $21 in extra bucks, which left my subtotal at just $1.14. Adding back in that $22, $21 in extra bucks leaves this receipt at $22.14, but I got back $4 for the deodorant, $5 for the toothpick brushes, and $5 for the head and shoulders. So $14 back in extra bucks. And then I submitted on over to Ibotta for $6 back, making this receipt just $2.14. Super duper awesome. But it gets even better for my budget because I paid with a Maryfields gift card. I paid just $3.99, swiped that for $3.99. Although that money's coming from a gift card, not from my bank account. So I'm actually, this is a wash, but I'm getting back that $6 in extra bucks. I mean, <laughs> $6 in cash from Ibotta. So I will write $6 moneymaker in my budget. Yay. Oh, and also technically that $10 extra buck I rolled was actually a care pass reward. So that's where you sign up and you'll get 10 bucks. You'll get a $10 extra buck every single month, but I paid only $40 for the full year. So it was like three dollars and thirty something cents a month that i actually paid for so that's kind of an extra almost seven dollars um that i get in extra free money every month so if you can ever sign up for the care pass so i got it in the email where they sent me that special promotion of forty dollars for a year so definitely check your emails and if you do get that definitely sign up totally worth it other than that i think it's like five dollars a month for the ten dollar reward so still an extra five dollars every month not a bad deal all right so i just did the one transaction i definitely wanted to try out that head and shoulders deal make sure all the coupons worked and came off together which they did and i had that 10 off of 70 on one of my accounts but i just couldn't get enough anything that I found necessary to reach up to that $70 mark. So it just wasn't worth it to just try to make a deal just to use that 10 off of 70. Cause even though I have not been getting them, you know, it doesn't mean just because I got it, I have to use it. They'll eventually come back around. So I did when I used this, um, because I didn't use it on that one also because I didn't have enough extra bucks to lower my cost down to where I would be okay with it. I only had $15 in extra bucks on that account. So it was still been a little bit of a higher out of pocket that I didn't want to do. So on my account that I do have a lot more extra bucks on, um, the transaction I did right now, it did print off a 10 off of 70. So I'm definitely gonna hang on to that. Hopefully next week, the deals are gonna be a little bit better and I'll be able to use that finally. Let me know what you guys are getting because I just have not had any luck. But 
anyway again thanks for being here don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to leave me a comment i love to hear from you guys and i hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day and we'll see you in the next one bye